Hello YouTube, welcome back. No floating head right now. Um, unfortunately, I went and took a little uh, break and I forgot to start recording when I came back. So let me just let me just fill you in on what's happening. Um, volcano eruption. I've accepted some petitions for people to live here, and I does that cover everything that happened in the interim? I think so. I laid down a weapon rack, put some doors in, whatever. General, just busy work. Okay, they don't really use weapon racks and armor stands, but you're under the impression that they're needed for sparring for whatever reason. Okay, well, we'll see. They're there for their use if they need them. Let's go over to Dwarf Therapist and look at all of our look at all of our new boys. Let's read them again. We've only got two. I approved three people to move in, but okay. Fair enough. Uh, one of them has a kill. Ooh, what's that? Notable kill. He's an elf killer. Oh, another lovely elf killer. Get him a spear, shall we? What does he use? A sword. We've got a spear dwarf and a sword dwarf. Do we instantly draft these guys? They did come with combat in mind, didn't they? So maybe we just draft them imme immediately. Locum and Udil. Have we already got a locum? We have. Got to be careful not to put the wrong locum in the... Uh, it's locum Lickerstat, not decimal or whatever it is. Okay, let's head over to Dwarf Fortress and put these guys in the military. Huh? What? That wasn't supposed to happen. <laughs> Let's try that again. There we go, into the military. So, in this slot, we want... Oh. Looks like they can't be drafted. Interesting. Interesting, okay. Fine, okay, let's unpause the game and let it carry on. We'll see what goes on. <laughs> This sounds like new background music for Sound Sense. Uh, yeah, it probably is. I haven't really paid attention to what goes on with it. It updates, it does stuff. It's all good. It's all good. <sighs> is there enough edge outflow to slow the lava? That's what I want to know. Boy, am I worried about this whole lava scenario. It's a problem. They'll apply at a later point for real citizenship, then you can order them around. Oh, okay, okay, we'll let them, uh, we'll let them stew for a bit. We'll let them stew. I swear there were supposed to be three of them, but... Oh well. <laughs> Excuse my sniffling, my nose is starting to rebel. Let's put some doors on this graveyard so people don't have to think about it as they go past. Oh, oh, oh actually, we should probably have some uh, burial receptacles, shouldn't we? Let's start placing those. Um... I think we'll start here. Okay, put one there. Then put one here, one here, one here, and one here, one here, and then wait one there, and one there. Is that good? One there. Seems good to me for now. That's enough coffins to keep us uh, ticking over. Keeping us ticking over. Hello, uh, can, can a tuna fish? Should have been able to pick that one up easier. Um, tile set and lazy nude pack. Correct, uh, I am using a tile set and I am losing, using lazy, lazy nude pack. Um, the tile set is uh, Phobos, I think. Let me quickly go and reference that. It is, yes, Phobos 16X. Just in case you were wondering. Just in case you were wondering. There are three. On arri one arrived at the first year, so he's in the group with the initial seven, minus the dead hero. Oh, okay, I see. I see. I get you. I understand. Don't you worry. Don't you worry. Oh, we've got another petition available. Okay, let's check that out. Shift P. Who we got here? Cyril Teachbridge wishes to reside in Slap Manor for the purposes of eradicating monsters. Cool, cool. It's all cool. I don't mind. We'll just get all, let all these monster hunters come in and we'll see what happens. Fingers crossed. We've got three petitioners now. That's good. Hopefully they'll all be uh, suitable military recruits. This is interesting. I've never noticed this before. I didn't even know it happened. I must have missed so many bloody recruits this way. Ah, oh, well. Can't be helped. Can't be helped. Okay. So those are all getting placed. That's good. Uh, we should probably get in and make some um, furniture and finished goods stockpiles, right? That makes sense. So P, uh, U for furniture. I am going to make the furniture stockpile here. 
There we go, and we'll make a finished goods stockpile over here. That doesn't need to be quite so large. It's the furniture stockpiles that are really the biggies. But fuck it, we'll just do a full, full area. There we go. Um, in here, well, we've still got room for other stuff to work on, so we'll just leave this space for now. At least we're getting stuff put into the places it wants to be in. Right? Or at least the places we want it to be in. Yeah? Sure. Is that built yet? No, of course not. Why would a crafts dwarf, craft dwarf? Crafts dwarf's workshop have been built? Oh my goodness. I've forgotten. I've forgotten what we were supposed to be building. Um, let's uh, first of all put our stockpiles in. Stone stockpiles. Screw this. I'm just going to do this whole... Oh, I can't go that far. Okay, we'll do them one room at a time then. Fair enough. There we go. You. And then you. And then you. Lovely. You are going to be four. Just metal ores. Just metal ore things. Uh, S. Stone. F, F, F. And then this bottom one as well. S. Stone. F, F, F. F in chat for the economic ores. There we go. And then actually, I do need a bar block stockpile, don't I? That's also a thing. So designate digging. Why is there a hot stone there? Oh, of course, because there's a magma underneath, you idiot. Uh, let's build ourselves a nice room there. Goody gumdrops, that should do. And that can be where we keep all our bars and blocks. And if we need to extend it, so be it. More petitions? Fucking hell. Edom Carried City wishes to reside in Slap Manor for the purposes of eradicating... Yeah, alright, go on then. Fucking hell. We're picking up military boys left, right and centre now all of a sudden. What's going on here? None of them are terrible either. He says, with no evidence. I'm just looking over at Dwarf Therapist. That's what I'm, that's what I'm seeing. You see, that's how I'm seeing it. Okay, you still building? You know what? I think maybe it's time think about making a bar block stockpile actually because that's probably filling up with blocks isn't it it'll have to be here um, stockpile uh, bar block Boom. start here no it's not going to do it okay go over manually with the keys down what okay it's not a full shift room fair enough fair enough Man, Rando, I cannot believe how quickly you got vaporised. That was silly. <laughs> Absolutely amazing how quickly you died. Okay, coming up the floor. Oh, come on. <coughs> Look at this. Oh. Ayah, uh, that trench is filling up. I don't like it. What? Hang on, let's find out what materials we've got in block form now. Uh, build, shift C, W. Uh, I want to make as big, a possible, as big as possible a wall. I'm going to put it there and I want to make it out of something that is... Um, magma safe. Is marble a magma safe rock? That's no, not enough of that lying around. Uh, Author clays, cobaltite, rhyolite, diorite. If somebody could let me know what of these blocks is, um, or stone, is safe, I will use it to start building the wall just to be on the safe side, because I'm getting super worried about that. <laughs> super worried. Hmm. Granite. Is that a... Uh... I haven't got any granite. don't know why I've even said granite. Quartzite. Is that? Oh, I don't know. Let's build it out of quartzite. For now. And if it's not magma safe, then, well, we'll just have to replace it. But let's get things cracking. Let's get this underway, at least. I don't think that's going to get built. We don't have any more with architecture, do we? Shit. Another flaw in my plans. Oh, bloody hell. Mind you, I do wonder if this would even have filled up if 
I hadn't breached it into that area. More petitions. Holy shit, another one wants to eradicate monsters. All right, okay. Crikey. Another visitor. Oh, yeah. Uh, let's go down to the um, dining area and put some more tables in. B, T, there we go. How many have we got? Four more. Uh, there we go, and then chairs. Good, chairs, let's put those in place. Uh, and then one there, and one there. Good, good stuff. We need those craft workshops up and running so we can make some nest boxes. That would be lovely. That would be super duper lovely. Oh, a weapon stockpile. We need that to put those um, bin those things in, don't we? P, uh, PP is for weapons apparently. Good old PP. Good old PP. Here's our weapon stockpile. I'm just for the sake of going all the way along the wall. There we go, that should be good. We should end up with some spike balls in there. Uh, what else is he going to have? Bins, well we want those, and barrels, we also want those. That's good. Right, down to food prep again. Are we still making stuff? We are, that's good. Kitchen hasn't been built. Farmer's workshop still hasn't been built. That's fine. That's fine. What's this? Is this the butcher's area? That's going to make a lot of miasma, isn't it? Maybe I should make this another food stockpile. Not that we're running out of space, you know. Not I know, rather. Quartzite should be magma safer. Oh, that's cool. But is it actually getting built? Yes, it is. Oh, sweet. Sweet. We, uh, this, is, this is our second big chance to save ourselves. Build. Capital C. Wall. Yes, please. Let's make it as tall as we can. Are you kidding me? Ah, Jesus. There we go. Quartzite. Bang. And then we go D, T. Get rid of that tree. In fact, let's chop every tree en route. Got any more? Any more trees right next to this thing? There we go. There's one there. There's a few, in fact. There we go. Let's cut these down as well. And I think I'll build the wall up to hit this when we get round to it. But we're getting there, we're getting there. Don't you worry, everybody. Don't you worry. Hopefully that tree will get chopped nice and quickly. Although it won't with our carpenter so busy. So maybe I should end some of his orders. Yeah, that makes sense. Let's go down to him. And we'll start making stuff through the manager for him. C, C, C. There we go. He'll go and chop those trees. That'll be nice. The new season oh, is summer. it's summer again. We haven't had any migrants yet. Have we gone all the way through the seasons? I think we have. Hmm. Okay, this is good. I like this digging the fortress and then reclaiming business. It's pretty, apart from the erupting volcano, it's glorious. <coughs> Fingers crossed, at least. May you give me an advice considering the wall? For sure. For sure. Do you want me to build it ten feet higher? Do you want me to get someone else to pay for it? Oh, memes! Anyway, sorry, yeah, please feel free. Don't be shy. Dive in. While we're waiting for the game to save, let's uh, pop over to Dwarf Therapist and take a look at what we've got. It's pretty interesting. Look, we've got uh, these guys here who've all been petitioning. They've all turned up with a little bit of military experience. What have you killed? You've killed an elf. You've killed an elf. My god, and our military commander's only killed a wombat. He's terribly inexperienced compared to the other people. Hmm. 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 I wonder. Go to their labours, see if they've got anything interesting. Ooh. Level 15 bow crafter. Nice. Any other interesting skills? Not really. Oh, the save's finished. Let's go back over to the fortress. Here we go. Okay, uh... Mason's busy. That's because he's building coffins, doors, blocks and thrones and tables. We need all those things, so let's keep them coming. 
Let's keep them coming. You can make rock blocks at a mason. For every rock you get four blocks and blocks are lighter so dwarves moving around are faster so you can get full tiles of wall for one rock and build them faster. Okay. Okay, I, I, I will try to build it more out of quartzite blocks then if I can. Um, am I making them out of quartzite? Oh, what? Can't see what I'm making them out of. Quartzite block pillar. Yeah, we are making some of this stuff out of uh, blocks, I think. Yep, blocks. It's all good so far. I just lucked out. I lucked out and did it the way I was supposed to. Oh, scoundrel. You're so lucky. So bloody, bloody lucky. So. Okay. I've probably got more graves to put in, haven't we? Let's uh, start thinking about them. All good. Whew. Probably got a lot of doors as well. Is there anywhere else we want doors desperately? Um, this floor doesn't really need doors at all. This one. Oh yeah, shit. We need to. Um, I need to take the person who's mining currently. Bear with me. I'm just doing some dwarf therapist stuff. There's our miner. Uh, let's read him quickly to make sure he's still the miner. He is, and we will just disable all of his hauling jobs. There we go. He's low level, but he should commit to some mining now. Hopefully we'll see one of these get activated. Yes? No? We'll check it out later. We'll check it out later. <laughs> he may well be training in his barracks. Nope. Somebody else is sitting around in his uh, barracks. Fair enough. If that's how it goes, and that's how it goes. Oh, more petitions. Jesus Christ. Eradicate monsters. Eradicate monsters. Eradicate monsters. Okay, we'll accept all of your petitions. Don't worry, you can all eventually move in. It's going to be great. You'll love it. So how many dwarves have we got now? We now have 15 dwarves. My goodness. Quite the group. How's the magma going? Show me the magma. Oh, they're taking their time building this wall. It's already three deep in the trench. Shit! Fucking hell! I don't know if that outflow is going to be enough. It's bottlenecking right here where I dug. What an idiot. What a buffoon. What a loony... Dickens. <laughs> I don't know. Come on. Come on. We just want that migration wave or a nice... Well, a migration wave, really. Because a, a caravan would be good. Maybe I should put architecture on for some of these... Uh, oh, the new boys can't give many... Uh, can't give many jobs, can I? Damn. Damn a voo. Hmm. Okay, we'll just wait for a while. If anyone can think of something that I've glaringly missed, then, you know, do pipe up. It would be nice to know. This is all going fine. Good. That's all fine. That's still not being dug out. Why? What is the miner doing? The miner is currently in an individual combat drill. Oh, okay, he is training. Okay, so he's not really much use <laughs> in terms of... Uh, Oh, there he is. There he is there. Maybe we need to do a month off, month on, month off training? Maybe? I don't know. What, is he getting much better at anything? Doesn't seem to be significantly better. Then again, who can say? Who can say? Oh, ding, ding! More visitors. My god, once we get the uh, tavern up and running, those dings are going to get pretty annoying. Speaking of the tavern, let's put some doors on the tavern. There we go. And maybe some tables. Put one in here. <laughs> put two diorite tables in. Maybe some chairs. There we go. That is going to end up being a tavern. Right now, maybe it doesn't look so grand, but uh, trust me, it will. It will. stockpiles doing. They don't seem to be putting any of the spike balls in there. That's a minor worry. Um, 
because that seems to have filled up with spiked balls. Why would you not do that? The carpenter's not actually doing anything at the moment. Is he chopping down trees? He should be chopping trees down. God damn you, carpenter. Why do birds suddenly appear every time I want you to do some wood cutting? What's he currently doing? Individual combat drill? What? No, oh, no, sorry. Current job. Construct building. Okay. Uh, maybe I don't want you doing that? Maybe. <laughs> maybe not. Let's let this wall get built. Maybe. Or maybe not. <laughs> I still don't know. God damn it, look at these llamas. They're full of milk and covered in wool. And have we actually done any of that? No, we just left them wandering around, as you do. Oh, we've got picks, battle axes and anvils here still. Well, that's nice. Good to know. Good to know. But until we get someone actually doing the business as a miner and mining this out, we can't actually channel out any holes here and put in our magma forges, which is what I really want to do, to be honest. I want to get that cracking. But so far, no dice. You want to eradicate monsters as well, do you? Uvash ringed caverns, welcome to the fortress. <laughs> Man, we're just getting tons of swords people turn up and no migrants. What's this about? Is everyone going to turn up individually? Because that could get really old really fast. I mean, how? when is our first wave of migrants going to arrive? That's what I want to know. Hmm. Hmm. Can we put some more beds in here? Nope, we haven't got any beds. Let's, uh, let's order up some more beds. Uh... Q, B, E, D, construct bed. I would like, make me 20 beds. Uh, also, I want bins, uh, lots and lots of bins. So, uh, Q, B, I, N, uh, I want wooden bins. Give me 40 of the bastards. There we go, that should do the job. We'll leave that going for now. Migrants should arrive in two months at the latest, so oh, that's good. Ah shit, I've just told the guy who was supposed to be chopping down trees to stop chopping down trees. Bugger. Oh, bugger. Maybe someone else will, will turn up with uh, tree chopping. What the fuck are you, and what have you nicked? Coati, surprise, surprise, you big bastard. Oh well. Oh well, never mind. They're taking an awful long time building this quartzite block wall. I'm not sure I like it. I'm not sure I like it. Ah, uh, maybe that could be it. That might be why we've not seen some. Just because the uh, reclaims messed everything up. Why do all these people come here to eradicate monsters? Do we have a significant monster problem? I mean, so far, I don't think we've had anyone fight us, have we? Or have we? Am I being a crazy pants? A silly bollocks? I don't know. But I can never tell. I can't tell the difference between sane pants and crazy pants. You won't be needing this anymore. <gasps> he took an iron breastplate! You fucking bastard! God damn it. There are probably more imps in the volcano, you're right. What with it spewing lava up to the surface. Now we've got to make another iron breastplate. Well, that sucks. That really sucks. Come on, miner, get working. Why are you not mining? Let me look at what other skills you've got in enabled. Uh, mining. You have recover from wounds, blah, blah, blah. Ah, blacksmithing, weaponsmithing, and armorsmithing. Well, you can't do any of those at the moment anyway, so... Oh, they're not his skills. Oops. Where are they? No? The guy who's supposed to be mining isn't doing anything. He's literally only got mining enabled and that's it. Oh, he's training, I keep forgetting that, yeah. He's in the army. Should I... Should I stop him training? Let's go to his schedule. M uh, and then S for schedule. That's A, div. MS, there we go. Uh, the intense friends. Uh, so we want to change, edit the order. There we go. Want to set it to a minimum of 
well, one soldier training, obviously. Uh, shift enter done. Uh, we want to copy that and then we want to uh, cancel that order, paste that order, cancel that order, paste that order, cancel, paste, cancel, paste, cancel, <laughs> paste, cancel. Cool, so it should be month on month off and we should end up with some digging happening in the next month, maybe? Hmm. Hmm. Intriguing. Intriguing! We're down to 60 frames a second. No doubt mostly that's due to the massive outflow of lava. Oh, look, it's four or five deep already! It's just going to overflow, isn't it? I wonder where the new level is supposed to be. Maybe it's going to fill up to like 100 Z levels up. That could be a problem. I hope hopefully this bug will get explored in the future and people will know what's going on. Is that another petition, that ding? No, it's just someone arriving to visit. Oh well. Ah, here we go. We can make this a dining room. There we go. And we can also assign it a location. Uh, add a location, in slash tavern, there we go, the Pumpkin of Pines, there we go. I know I haven't made it a meeting hall, but we'll see what happens. Because this, this is a meeting hall, right? Yeah, cool. And that's really what we want, right? We want it to be a meeting hall. Uh, let's put down some more tables if we can. I've only got one, got another chair. Yeah, we've got three of the buggers. Lovely. Cool. Right. Uh, probably got more graves as well, haven't we? B, N. Burial receptacle. There we go. How many? Two. Fine. Let's put those in. Lovely. Keep placing. Let's put a door on the grave site as well. There we go. Nice and closed off. Um, I think we're good for now. I think we're all good for now. Still nobody on site with architecture. This is getting a bit hairy now. I would not mind having somebody actually capable come along. That would be nice. Pliz, pliz migrants. Pliz arrive. For migrants. Mm. Just as my hope was waning. Come on, boys. On site. One. Two. Three. Four. Is that it? Four dwarves. Okay, we had 16. We now have 20 what? Oh, shit. Okay. They're not... Uh, okay, they're all mixed in with the people who have petitioned to come along. Ah, oh, bollocks. Let's get some of those in as well. Uh, you want to eradicate monsters? Fine, 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 fine. Okay, so let's pause the action. Head over to Dwarf Therapist and try and unpick who's who. Now all these red ones, uh, these aren't citizens. So if we sort uh, migration wave, is there a citizen flag? I don't think there is, is there? Profession, what are these? Axeman, Maceman, okay, if we sort by profession, yeah, it's bumped them all together. Ah, so the new migration wave is actually only three people. A cook, a farmer, and a craftsman. Oh, thank God for that. We've got a craftsman. He may, only be, he may only be a wood crafter, but at least he can build the craft workshops. Also a brewer and a cook. Brilliant. Uh, who else had brewing? They can now have that deactivated on their list. Ah, except they're really good at it. Adept grower, proficient brewer. What about this guy? Is he a... What kind of grower is he? Grower, grower. grower. He's here somewhere brains collapsed. Farming. Yeah, that's it, grower. Uh, so farming. No, no one's got any farming. So if we deactivate this guy's... Deactivate the farmer's brew, even though he's really good at brewing, we'll take him off the job so he's just a farmer. <laughs> Hopefully that will free him up with a bit of extra time. Uh, have any of these guys got any military 
Oh, one of them's got a kill. What is it? It's a goblin! Oh. Stackard. Stackard Ubululikist. What do we say have here? Oh, quite the boy, aren't you? Quite the boy. What did he kill it with? He's got no weapon skills. He's got no combat skills. Oh, man. Gotta hear this story. Tell all. Everyone else has killed elves, but they've actually got weapon skills. You've killed a goblin, apparently... By accident? I don't know. Seems odd. Um, let's give one of these bad boys some architecture. What about you? You're a craftsman. You're a farmer. You're a cook. Uh, well, you can be a craftsman slash architect then. Go on. Where are you? Architecture. Bang. Hopefully that'll get the wall done quicker. Boom. Let's go back to the fortress and see how this unfolds. The new boys have all arrived. Hopefully the wood chopper will come and get rid of this tree or they'll start building these bloody walls quicker. Uh, build. Shift C. Wall. Uh, we want it to be Nice long wall. There we go. I know I'm going to forget to put one in. But fingers crossed it will work out. Uh, build another wall. Uh, here we go. Put that in there. Also quartzite. Build another wall. That's it. Lovely quartzite. Quartzite, lovely quartzite. Quartzite, there we go. Okay. Come on, guys, get this wall up. We're on the verge of a catastrophic overflow, and I'm not happy about it. I'm not happy about it at all. This quartz wall isn't in place in time. I'm not going to do anything about it. Oh, fucking hell. I may have beansed it. <sighs> okay. How are our orders doing? J, M. Brewing's fine. Constructing beds and bins is all fine. Good. The spike balls don't appear to be being binned up and put in the weapons. I'm a bit worried about that. I, thought they, I definitely thought they were considered weapons. What other stockpiles can we make? We've got a finished good stockpile. We've got a weapon stockpile. Ammo, food, coins, refuse, wood, bars and blocks, leather and sheets and armour. Huh. Huh. Hmm. Interesting. I don't know what I'm missing, but I'm definitely missing something. We're not stockpiling all the wooden materials like we should. And we should have a load of beds as well. I was making tons of beds, but I don't see any in the furniture stockpile. What are these? The things that look like little bits of pants. Little pairs of pants. A walnut wood crutch. Pigtail rope. I think it's just a matter of not having enough people to do all the hauling. That seems to be the issue. Still not digging this shit out though, is he? What's up with this miner guy? Let me just pop over to the dwarf therapist again and have a little look at what he's up to. Current job. Store an item in a stockpile. Fairly certain I told you not to do that, mate. Yep. Yep, definitely. Hmm. Okay. Well, let's see how that works out. Maybe it will work out okay. We'll have to see. Ah! Oh my god. The weir hyena Ave Lepis Rave has come. A large hyena twisted into humanoid form. It is crazed for blood and flesh. Its eyes glow yellow. Its dark brown hair is unkempt. You will now know why you fear the night. Well, now you will know why you fear the night. Okay. So, enter to close window. Space to resume. I don't think so. He's down here. Oh, shit. He's down here. Okay, so let's activate the squad menu. Intense friends! Activate! Uh, enter kill creature at cursor. Is that where he is? There he is. Bang. 
Let's hope his armour holds out and stops him from getting bitten. Space, resume. Off he goes. Uh, we're actually going to click this bad boy here. And we're going to follow. Is it capital F? It is capital F. There we go. Let's see what happens. Well, it's run into our wild stock, our livestock. Oh, oh, it's getting fought. It's getting fought. Who's winning? Oh, there's blood. Oh, shit. Oh, dear. Well, it turns out one dwarf in iron armour with hammers is... What the hell? He's a goddamn elf. Uh, let's check my... I'm just going to quickly check the health screen, make sure nobody's been wounded. And, uh... Right, Logum Act Portal. What are you? What do you do? What's your general role in the fortress? Oh, shit. Please don't be our goddamn manager. He's the metalsmith that never got to be. We're probably going to have to kill him. How do we isolate this fucker and get him axed? And also, how do we suddenly... I mean, okay. I know what's happened here. I've figured it out. The reason that guy died is because we diverted from Crickbeard's tradition. Now that this boy is back in his elfin form, what we're going to do is we're going to say... Um, oh, wait, is he not dead? Is our military dwarf not dead? Was that him who's just been wounded? He's not dead. I mean, he's got lacerations, so he's definitely infected. <laughs> okay, right, here's, here's how it works. Here's the Crypbeard's tradition. Everybody gets drafted. We go and pummel people. Okay? Everybody's in the intense friends now. Oh, is that everybody? Really? Oh man, we've only got a few people we can actually draft. <laughs> That's insane! Okay, squad, intense friend, kill. Go. Actually, wait, let's uh, focus on the... Focus on them. There we go. Reset the kill order. Bang, they're coming in, they're doing the punching. He's not infectious at the moment, so as long as we can take him out before he transforms, we're all good. We're all good. Come on. Come on. Punches. Punches. Pummel him down. Don't let him transform. Don't let him transform. Do not let him transform. Let's check. Let's have a little look. The ghostly miner, Rando303, is fighting. Okay. Sure. Uh, the recruit punches the elf. Keep fighting. Just take him out. Once everybody's involved, it's going to be nice and easy. You're going to get tons of punches in. He's going to go down. And once he's on the floor, we just encircle, kick, punch. It's all good. It's all good. Come on, take that fucking elf down. He's going to transform into a weird hyena, and you know it. We've still got to kill the goddamn... Um... Well, hopefully he's already dead. But we've got to kill the guy who got injured, for sure. I mean, really for sure. We should have called everyone inside and just waited it out, shouldn't we? Don't let him transform. Punch him up. Come on, guys. Duff up the elf. Knock his teeth out. Smash his face in. Stamp on his testicles. Gouge its eyes out. Oh, I see blood. I think this is it. I think this is it. Bang! He's dead. Let's have a quick look here. Uh, the elf isn't appearing. Oh, here it is. The elf. There we go. The wrestler bites the elf in the head, tearing apart the muscle. The wrestler latches on firmly. Oh, cool. That's nice. Um, so, what's the situation now? Um, right, the intense friends, we're going to go into the military screen and we are going to remove everybody from... There we go. Cool. Now we now no longer have anybody in the intense friends. I'm just going to refresh and see if Logan survived. <laughs> no, it looks like the guy who got infected died. The only wounds we have, or well, I say wounds in inverted commas, are thirst. So, okay, we may have well have lost our uh, fighty boy, but it's not the end of the world because we don't apparently have any infected. Although that said. We are about 
to get to overflow here. Um, shit. Big shit. Hmm. Uh, this is this. I think it's the latest Dwarf Fortress version. Um, Wald Schrapt MX. It's um, ten four four. That's the one we want. That's the one we've uh, got. Sorry, it is an it is a grim outlook. But to be honest, I think the fortress can survive. Well, I say that, provided the lava doesn't overflow and drown us all, we can survive. Fingers crossed. <laughs> This is not going to be enough of an outflow, is it? God damn it. As soon as we see it overflow this lip, we know this is a, a lost cause. And we're just going to have to try again. I really like digging it out like that, but you can't reclaim these volcano fortresses easily. It's a bit of a bummer, to be honest. Still, you learn your lessons. You learn your lessons. Well, I mean, most people learn their lessons. I, I, I don't. Oh, 4410, not 1044, okay. Farmer's been missing for a week. Really? Why is that then? Oh, gold. I think we have some more animals to assign to this pasture, actually. Let's, uh, let's do that. Oh no, it's just a buttload of puppies. Oh, goats, yeah, get rid of that. I don't want him wandering around anywhere else. Llamas, yaks, it's all good. Okay, fair enough. Fair enough. Fair enough. Okay, okay, okay. What's going on here? Nervous glances. It's getting to sixes and sevens now. It would be beautiful if it just stops at a nice level seven, filled up, right to the brim, but no more. I mean, that would be nice. I have a really bad feeling that that's not going to happen. But we'll do our best. I say do our best, but we'll keep our fingers crossed and hope for the best. This quartzite wall wasn't being built nearly fast enough. I should have started it from the very beginning when we embarked, shouldn't I? What a fool! What an utter idiot. Still? Again, and like I say, it could have been worse. We could have died instantly. We could have been crushed under flowing rocks and lava immediately, like we were last time. Are you actually going to put anything in here? Copper battle axe. Iron mail shirt, iron helm, iron chain leggings. Why would you put that in a weapon stockpile? That should surely go in an armour stockpile. P. Armour? D. Armour. There we go. Let's make an armour stockpile. There you go, there's an armor stockpile right next to the weapon one. Lovely. Are any of these bloody people who come here to slay monsters actually going to do the job? Mind you, do I really want them chasing after weird creatures? That's danger, danger, Will Robinson. Oh man, look at all this. It's trouble and no mistake. Still. I mean, these are the these are the dangers of the volcano embark. This was such a nice sight as well, though, wasn't it? Oh, kicking myself. We can't do these reclaims with volcanoes, or we need to take very deep precaution because this was insufficient precaution. We should have made a much more effective trench with a wall. Hey, uh, we should have had it flowing off the edge of the map as well. What's that, a skunk? Okay, don't worry. No need to panic about skunks. They're not much of a worry. It's everything else that you've got to worry about. Oh, we've made our craft dwarf workshops. Lovely. Excellent news. Uh, in that case, we can start making rock uh, crafts, right? Rock jugs, maybe? No, oh, no, we don't have a rock craftsman. We've got a wood crafting dwarf, and that's it. And I don't want to start wasting wood on that kind of stuff. We're going to need that later down the line, I'm sure, for uh, gloriously expensive spiked wooden balls. <laughs> oh, it's all sevens and sixes. Look, it's going to overflow. Keep watching, scoundrel. Come on. I don't know why I'm being so damn vigilant. Yeah, sure, you can turn to fight monsters. Can you fight lava? Can you fight molten stone? 
Is that something you're capable of? Fingers crossed, eh? Because that would be bloody lovely. Very useful indeed. Although, now that I think about it, I quite like being able to induce this um, eruption state. It's quite an interesting thing to try and work around. Maybe another time we'll try it again and see what we can do. Yeah, sure, eradicate monsters. Why not, mate? Why not? Everyone's here doing that these days. It seems to be all the rage. None of them seem to actually go out and fight the monsters when they turn up, though. They let my guys die. Yay, they say. Oh, shit. Um, oh, hang on. I just realised put all these coffins in. Have any of them been assigned for making tombs? Uh, not, I don't want to make a tomb. I want it assigned for burial. Yes, B. There we go. Here we go. Get every single one done. Boom. Now we can get that boy buried. Lovely. <laughs> if this does... We're done. We're done. There's no way we can defend against this. If the level's just going to keep rising, then, uh, yeah, there's nothing we can do. The magma's just going to flow in and kill us all. That's a bit disappointing, really, isn't it? This was such a nice embark spot as well. Oh, the ghost of Rando looks on in the lava flow that took his life. Oh, weeping his ghostly tears. Boo-hoo. Oh, why did I die? Doesn't matter. Don't cry. Everyone's going to die. Yeah, overflowing. We don't have anywhere near enough time to make this wall. Ah, well. Well, 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 well. Well, we can't do the abandon and reclaim gimmick on a magma, on a, on a volcanic embark. Not without serious pre-planning. That is stupendously annoying. Oh, just as the bed order was completed as well. Oh, dear. Well, I think that definitively means that we're just not going to be able to stay here, are we? We need to do something else. We need to work on another bloody fortress. Cryptbeard's Eleven, another busted flush. Except it's a different kind of busted flush, because we're actually pootling along, along okay. It's just the fact that we have this enormous erupting volcano that's going to cause us end time troubles. So, um, shame. Shame, 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 as they say in Game of Thrones as you walk naked through the streets. Do the streets? Through the streets. This is a really disappointing outcome. I was desperately hoping for far more fun times. Wait a minute, we've got another dead guy? Ah. Well, it appears that we had a, uh, a weird spiral coming anyway, because look, we've got some more dead people, and they were not killed. Let's have a quick look. Uh, who's, who's lying there? Whose corpse is it? Uh, you are... No, it doesn't say. Oh, Raoul Abandeg's rotten corpse. Let's have a look at Raoul Abandeg. Uh, death, horror... Injured badly. The elf punches the recruit in the upper body with her left hand, bruising the muscle, jamming the left false ribs through the left lung, and tearing the left lung. Holy shit! He got beaten up by the elf when it wasn't even an elven form. Embarrassing. Highly embarrassing. Well, it doesn't matter. Your shame will be engulfed in lava soon enough, and nobody will remember the awful things that happened to you. Tragedy, I know. Oh, look! Fleeing kangaroos! Just what you want to see. Kangaroos fleeing an overflowing volcano. Ashes. Ah, bugger, bugger, bugger. Well, those of you watching the recording, uh, this is the end of Fortress 11. I think I might have to put Fortress 10 and 11 in a playlist together because uh, they seem to have thematic similarities. Saving? The time what for? What for, I say? <laughs> Seems a bit unnecessary, doesn't it? Seems a bit much. Seems like precisely the kind of thing we don't need right now. What a bastard, eh? 
What a monstrous bastard. It's annoying, I haven't got enough time to start a new fortress tonight, but I mean, what else is happening here? What else is happening? Anyway, YouTubers, thank you very much for watching. It's been a pleasure recording for you. Hopefully we'll cross paths again, and I'll see you down the line. Bye!